electrocardiogram shortly we can say ecg or ekg it is a measuring displaying and recording the electrical activity of the heart also it is a painless non invasive way to help diagnose many common cardiac problems in all patients so the electrocardiography is the process of producing an electrocardiogram it is a graph of voltage versus time of the electrical activity of the heart using an electrodes which is placed on the skin so the electrical stimuli is amplified to create rhythmic strip by a machine that consistently produces representations of the heart's electrical activity next moving on to the conduction system of the heart it involves sa node av node bundle of his and left and right bundle branches here the p wave that indicates atrial depolarization whereas pr interval indicates impulse delay at av junction and the qrs complex indicates the ventricular depolarization otherwise you can say electrical excitation of the ventricles then t wave indicates ventricular repolarization what can you get from ecg heart rate cardiac rhythm chamber enlargement and conduction abnormalities now you are going to see how to connect the leads in the different species of animals in bovine ecg is recorded on a standard base fx lead system using lymph lead 1 for this animal is kept in standing position no clipping or saving is carried for the electrode attachments the positive electrode is of lead 1 that means left arm is attached to the skin of the fifth intercostal space just cordal to the olecranon the negative electrode which means the right arm is attached to the jugular furrow one third of the neck on either side or mid of the neck then the neutral electrode should be placed on away from the heart you can see the base affect lead system using lymph lead 1 then ecg recordings are made either in right lateral recumbency or in standing position using base affect lymph lead system in small ruminants ECG recording in the rescued deer we can record either in base affect lead or standard bipolar lymph lead or augmented unipolar lymph lead sum however the base affect lead provided the most uniform ecg pattern and higher mean amplitudes than other standard lymph leads in case of rescued deer in case of canine patients these patients should be placed on the right lateral recumbency to record diagnostic ecg this position is standard for taking correct ecg recording because the standardized measurements are all obtained in this right lateral recumbency only however placing the patients in the right lateral recumbency is sometimes unrealistic and these cases the ecg is be still be valuable for assessing the heart rate and rhythm but it is not the true diagnostic ecg then place the limb electrodes on the patients as labeled so the each electrode should be labeled with the limb to which it's attached for recording the ecg each electrode are color coded and will be placed on the patients as follows for the left arm yellow color right arm red color lead left leg green color lead right leg black lead but the color code is optional electrode should be attached to the elbows and stifle limb should be held parallel to the floor and perpendicular to the long axis of the patients for the hairy breeds the area must be clipped before adhesive patches or alligator clips are attached record ecg the bird is kept in standing position on electrically non conductive area with manual restraint and ecg is obtained via standard bipolar lymph leads for this alligator clips are attached to the skin of the birds at base of the right and left wings and 
right and left thighs and ECG is recorded as per the standard protocols. In contrast to the mammals, the pathway of depolarization in turkey is from epicardium to endocardium. The avian cardiovascular system shares many similarities with those of the mammals and several other unique and specific details are exist between the species. In snakes, the heart is found along the midline axis and its longitudinal position varies with the species. In marine and freshwater snakes, it is positioned near the middle of the body. Whereas in the non-tree dwelling snakes, the heart is found at about 25% of the total body length and about 15% in arboreal species that is more cranially the heart is located. It, the placement of the electrodes varies according to the species in snakes but it is usually inspired from the traditional four limb fleet placement. Here the leads are placed to heart length cranial and caudal to the heart and ECG is obtained as per the standard method. And also we have performed ECG in rescued squirrels, monitor lizard and uh, rabbits as per the standard protocol.